Hey guys, hope you all have been well. Welcome back to my channel. On today's video, I'm gonna be doing my try on haul first impressions-ish, cause some of these I have tried already. I don't have products for every single category, but we're gonna make do with what we have. Am I too bright? I don't know. Is this better? I think this is better. My hair is still drying and it's not uh, luscious and gorgeous to begin with, so I'm sorry. Elf body primer. I'm just about done with my Tatcha one. I usually scrape, but oh yeah. Dang, that's very similar to Tatcha in terms of consistency. I don't know if you can tell. Just dug my finger in it. Wait. So this is what I'm getting. First impressions again, guys. I don't know how it's gonna last, but I actually like the way this one feels more. It just doesn't feel as emollient as the Tatcha one, which is great for me. So far, we're one for one. This is, it feels good. I think I'm gonna do my brows next. So Morphe Latte Brow Pencil, Micro Brow Pencil. And I did use this on one brow, but now let's see it on both. I did find that this ended up getting just a bit creamier after I used the like beginning portions of the pencil, but I still don't think it's as creamy as the Benefit one. And for the 50 millionth time, I prefer drier brow products. Oh my gosh, this has a spoolie, I forgot. What y'all think? Let's do the other brow. So based on first impressions, I'm gonna say I like this. I don't know if I would go so far as to say that this is better than ABH. It's kind of a reach, but I do think that I like it better than the Benefit. Is that fresh enough for you? Mm -hmm. How much product is in here? That's a lot. See that? Hey. Foundation. So I'm going to use the L'Oreal True Match. I don't know what the combination will end up being because this is the first time popping this bad boy open. But again, it is in Light Ivory W2. And then I'm using the NARS Longwear Radiant Foundation in Valencia. And this is too deep for me. So let's concoct. Let's see where we go with the color. I know most people kind of like mix it on their hands and do this little swatch thing. I just go for it. Life's too short, guys. Just gotta go for it sometimes. I don't want full coverage. I'm more of a medium, medium coverage kind of gal. See, like this doesn't do that streaky thing that the Maybelline, the Maybelline one does for me. The Fit Me foundation. I don't like it. Maybe it's just the way that it goes on my skin. The texture just. It doesn't suit it, but look, it's so much better like this. L'Oreal True Match, you're always there for, for me since the beginning. Oh, pimple. Yeah, extra dab on you. It's uh, the time of the month. This is just my old concealer. Um, Too Faced, born this way, right? Born this way. Yep, almond. I need to get a darker version of this. I don't like how light it looks under my eyes. Apply that and get ready for some my shadow. I'm acting like I can see my viewfinder. It's farther than I can see with my eyes. See how, oh, ugh. I don't like it. But I'm trying to use it because it's the concealer that I have the most of. And so I wanna balance out the ratio. I'm so tempted. Stop talking every video, and I bet it's about food. Hold on. Um, oh, bronzer thing. This uh, Lancome Tiny Doll Ultra Wear Makeup Stick in suede, 450 neutral. A little on the nose. As I put a lot on. Where's my console brush? My brush, brush, brush. There it is. It's good, right? See? I think I got this for. 20 bucks, 21. This was on sale. Look at how easy it is to blend. Let's put some under my eyes because it's too bright. Where's my nose brush? My nose cream brush. Hey, where are you? There you are. 
Mm, so easy to blend. Well, what do you expect when you use a foundation as a contour product? Rimmel, stay matte, translucent, transparent. Oh, this whole time I was saying it's translucent, it's transparent. Blend this baby out. I know it looks like I dab a lot of powder on my brush because I constantly go back to it, but I literally do this. Just that. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, look at that. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do, I want to do the eyes last. Um, Butter Bronzer, Physician's Formula. I wonder if this is even going to show up on my skin, but let's see. Got it on my brush. Tap, tap. Oh, that's showing up a little bit. This smell is gross. Every time I get closer to my nose, it just smells. Oh, my nose, I forgot. This is not contouring my nose as well as the other bronzers that I own, but it's also not as deep, so to be expected. I'm gonna be frank with you. I don't know how long I can keep this bronzer. I really can't stand the smell. Let's just put on blush, right? Yeah, blush. Let's use Madeline. This is not new. NARS. Like how damaged it is. Look at, look at these. This is Madeline. I think it's discontinued. So I should use a different one. <laughs> I know Deep Throat is still available. Let's use this one because the name is, is just so angelic. Deep Throat is actually one of my favorite um, NARS blushes. <laughs> Oh, blush, baby. Oh, oh, bl oh, blush, yes. Love me some blush. Let's put some on the nose. Why not? Forehead. Let's go ham with it. Love blush. Okay, highlighter. <laughs> not gonna lie, I'm kind of scared about this highlighter. Julia's Place, the Tribe Highlighter Volume 3. You know who I saw this from? It dawned on me after I made the last video saying I didn't remember. This I saw from Smoky Glow. She had shown this highlighter. She swatched it and I was like, what's that? Why I don't know about it. God, there's barely on my brush. There's barely on my, shut your mouth. Who Englished you? Oh. That's really strong. I feel like I have to like dip and then like wipe off. What do you guys think? Too much? I like the shade. It looks pretty. I thought it was going to be really ashy on my skin, but it's not, which is good. I just, I don't, I don't like the fact that I have to really control what I'm doing. Should I just do my lips while we're here? Walkery, NARS, velvet matte lip pencil. Just a tin color pop, Waikiki. Okay, blush brush. What are we gonna take first? Made to blush, transition. First color we're gonna use, cheek to cheek, checked? Yeah, cheek to cheek, this middle one here, we're gonna use as the uh, crease color. And then we're gonna use How Rogue, loose, whatever this one here we're going to use that to do inner and outer lid we're going to do a halo eye blossom up here the shade and pop a bottle is this a super shock i don't know let me know if you do know but i'm going to pop that in this like the dead center and this more so majority of the center of the lid i'm just going to do one eye i like that that's enough pigment. Oh, by the way, that was a Morphe 502. And this is a MAC 217, cheek to cheek. Yes, my brush was already dirty because, because. All right. Why did I just sound like a gremlin? That's so pretty. 221, where are you? D. Dirty. 221 for MAC. How? Rogue, Rouge, Rouge. I always get that good. R-O-G-U-E is Rogue. <sighs> Shut up, Annabelle. Just do your makeup. Ooh. 
beautiful. I rarely have complaints about ColourPop eyeshadows unless they're pressed pigments. So I like this. This is the first time I've ever purchased a pre made palette like a curated one by them maybe i'll do more of it oh look at that look at the blend you know foxy eye trend oh yeah where you at bella hadid check my eye out blossom up my finger looks dual chrome hey i have a shade like this from ColourPop. so pretty i naturally love colors like these Oh, yes. I'm tempted to just wipe this on my pants, but my pants are black. Dang it. Pop a bottle. Put that dead center. Going like this, thinking I have thin fingers. Is this the Super Shock formula? It feels different from the other shimmers. I wonder. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. Kind of looks wet. So she said. Let me do the other eye so we can move on to lashes and round all of this up. But I'm not. I'm not mad at that. Look at how wet that shade looks. Right dead center. Wow. This has got to be a different formula. Okay. Both eyes are done. This is what it looks like. I really like that center shade. Like it's so. Bam, you know, it's kind of like a liquid eyeshadow without the liquid part. I'm, I'm just so well, well vocabulary. Ardell Mega Volume 259s. These were the ones I was so excited about. Wait, I don't have lash glue. Dang it. I'll be back and I'm back. Guys, this is the best glue, the brush ons from Ardell. Robert Welsh says so himself, and he's a genius. Does Hindash use it as well? I, f I don't know. They're my newest like makeup artist obsessions and painted by Spencer. I just found him recently. He's more like glam, but still so talented. I'm jealous of their, their skills. Stay down. They're so fluffy. Just like me. Press them down, press them down. Oh, I don't have a spongy. Fix Plus. The, this is what butter bronzer should have smelled like. And that is it. Is my hair dry now? Yeah, it's still damp. <laughs> Damn it. Thank you guys so much for joining me in this video. I hope you enjoyed this first impressions. I'm pretty thoroughly impressed with everything really. Um, foundation was good. I love the combination with um, my darker foundations like the Lancome stick. I like the putty primer. Again, I think I like it better than the Tatcha one. The eyeshadows were good. I like them. I just like the color story. So. I'm naturally gonna like it because I also like the formula. I like the eyebrow pencil and the bronzer was like the worst thing. I The color is okay. It's not as deep as my other bronzers so I would probably go, need to go with a heavier hand and that means I have to smell it more which is horrible. The highlighter, I like it. I just am worried about how intense it comes off because of my textured skin. I don't like to put a lot of highlighter on naturally, but the color itself is good. And these lashes, these fluffies, oh yes, I like them. All right guys, you know the drill, full list of products down below. I'll also be posting it on Instagram, so you can check me out in the first link the description box down below. I will post a photo of my makeup look over there with a full list of products in the caption. Till the next video, I hope you all are doing well, taking great care of yourselves. I will see you all next time. Bye guys. Strumming my pine with his fit chips. I don't want to clean this. I just don't. I don't want to do it. Just want to sit here and eat the chips. Stir up my snake plant. So. I have to put away my light. Fix all this. Fix all that. Upload this. That is a sick and me too. Yeah.
thought I dropped a chip when I just dropped the eyelash holder. Life is good. <laughs>